Is that a big mark? Actually? Oh, that is a big fish. Hayden, please make this happen. Is he still there? Yeah. Okay, I need a fish. Oh, wait. Oh, <laughs> that's all the same one. This is big. This is big? Ooh. <laughs> oh! <laughs> what is up, guys? Today, we're going ice fishing in a float plane. We got Hayden Martin. Hayden, it's been a while. What happened since we talked last time? Wrote my uh, commercial license and passed it, so. Boom! He was, uh, he had his private license before, which means he could fly, fly buddies, fly for fun, but now he can fly commercially. So you could be flying for any of the Bay Area lines, right? You'd be flying for... Cast to right, and then uh, we'll be good to go. He'll be flying for uh, Delta probably in a couple months. Not quite. <laughs> Anyways, Thanks for the Super Cub thing. We're in the Super Cub. This is such a sweet little ride. You've seen it in a couple videos now. And yeah, we're going lake hopping today. Uh, the lakes, the smaller lakes just got thick enough. Big lakes are still wide open. The small lakes are frozen and safe. Anyways, what's the plan? Walleyes? Walleyes, and then uh, some lunch. I hope it starts. Will there be a snack? Did you bring any snacks? I brought some snacks. Some Tim Beebs? <laughs> some Tim Beebs, yeah, yeah. We, uh, we got some walleye dice. That was probably one of my favorite flights I've ever been on. We are back. Wow, the sun is just like, life is so good right now. Yes! Like, I can't think of a more perfect auger for flying and it matches the plane too. Right. All right, Hayden, can you drill some holes for me? Always gonna drill some holes. What were you saying about the walleyes before? So I hope they're like little Caesars, hot and ready. <laughs> oh, this guy cracks me up cracks me up. Is this thing gonna take my wrist off? Maybe. Throw the hole! <laughs> that wow. did almost that rip your arms. Does it have some bad. torque? Grab both rods, man. There's a fish there. There is a fish. Oh, there's a fish coming up already. You're kidding me. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Hayden took <Yeah>. sets. <laughs> Hayden, what you lack in fishing skills, you make up for in flying skills. Well, that's good. Because one of them kills you a lot easier than the other. Oh, oh. Oh, <laughs> what? Did you just no, break off? No, the No, Jay. come on. That's a braid knot that broke. Come on. That's on you. Dude. Jay. Did you check your drag? Drag's good. Jay, that was a good one too. He smoked it. This is, this is so painful to be a part of. Look at that fish coming. Look at that big mark. That's a big pike. <laughs> That's a big mark. I got one on me too. Oh, there's three fish down there. This is absolutely madness. Look at that big pike coming in. Dude, I've, that's a 40 inch fish. I've caught some. That's a big pike. Big. I got oh. It. oh. I got it. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> what a start to the day. Dude, that's, that's probably a high 30, 40 inch pike. You lost it. Oh. Did you see how big that fish was on no! the scope? Oh, I just got smoked, I think. Did I miss one? What's going on here? That's a little better. Come on. Come on. <laughs> oh. <laughs> we suck at fishing. I got it. Nice, Jake. We are finally, finally gonna land a fish. I can feel it. This feels like it's not gonna get released. <laughs> we are doing a catch and cook for lunch today. And that oh, is a nice. 
exactly what we're looking for. Today is gonna be a fun day. And the shield, my boy Hayden. I think two like that and we got enough for dinner. I like using hemostats. These long pliers, whatever you wanna call them, for getting the baits out when they're deep. This is a new dinner bell color, 3 16 This is called the Lip Smacker, a color that I helped design and it's working. Ooh, look at that fish coming in on the right. Can't, oh, that's why I can't see my- Just own. look at the live scope. He's about to eat you. He's about, don't put, don't put your graph in. <laughs> you just missed him. Look at the live scope. Don't look at the flasher. I don't even know why you have your flasher in. Oh, he's gonna just chow the rattle bait. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> oh, that's a nice walleye. This is like as good as it gets. Fly in ice fishing. I just love it. We'll keep a smaller guy. Yeah. Sweet. Oh. Oh, there's two. Oh. Is there three? Three. Look at this. These are the days I dream of. Oh, he's, oh, ho, ho. <laughs> nice. Yes. <laughs> Beauty. That one's probably going in the pan. That one can go in the pan. All right, we're good for food. That's pretty good. Wanted to bring the plane in for optics. Guy just pulls up in the spot, lands in his plane, drills two holes and we're just cranking walleyes. Oh, look at you, look at that one. That one's killing you. <laughs> You're so bad. We're gonna have another montage. This, why is it never ending? What's going on? Why haven't you caught him yet? Come on. Hayden's hook sets, they're free and they're beautiful. That bait's gone. They're, they're not nipping at it. They're just inhaling. <laughs> Bleeding. Do you want me to show the camera or no? Well, we should show them both of our fish. Give them a little dunk. Super cub in the background. Sun is still rising and we're crushing some backcountry walleyes. I think mine's bigger, Jake. I know. All right, so he's got the jig and spoon. I'm using the tantrum. That lighting stuff, I forget the number. The medium one, the medium one. Not the micro, but the medium one. You already showed him this. It is you? so bright. You didn't bring sunglasses, Jake. No, I didn't. That is one thing I hey, forgot. Hey, look at all the bait over there. I know, that's pretty cool, eh? Here you go. Oh, wow. Nice. We've not been fishing long. We've only, <laughs> these are the first two holes we drilled. Fishing in Canada is unfair as it is. And then you add a, a, a plane and it just, it really kind of stacks the odds in your favor. It is pretty insane to know how hard Americans have to try to catch to, fish. To all my American friends, you guys are so much better fishermen than us because you have to work so much harder. Like a guy like Tom Boley, is a way better fisherman than me. He fishes for pressured walleyes on, yeah, these, these public lakes. Here we are flying in to these backcountry lakes that never get fished. Hayden's breaking off, missing hook sets. Breaking off Jay's lines, his fault. We don't have proof of that. Oh, there's a nice one coming in hot on the right. <laughs> this is a baby. It's good for you. Yeah, lose it. I don't think it's a baby. Okay, never mind. Nice. This is the first time I've used this color. Really? Yep. Is it working? I mean, they'd probably <laughs> eat anything. Let's be honest. Well, since the last video, Hayden got a haircut. He had some sick flow, and now I'm, I'm working on it. He finally got a haircut, but I'm lacking. That was one of my biggest regrets of the year, to be honest. That was your biggest regret of the entire year was cutting your hair. If only we had a quick way oh, oh, oh. of going and getting some. Nice. Whoa, what's going on? Oh, another one. Look at this. Let me give my- Double. <laughs> well, that's decent. Double header number two. This does not suck. <laughs> I think the best part is that we just, yeah. These are the first holes we drilled <laughs> and we're not using second lines. It's just, this is kind of like cheating. 
Like there's two fish down there now. Ooh, look at that. Whoa. That's a big fish. I think that's multiple. No, that's one big fish. Dude, that is a big pike or something. What's going on? It's just like upright right now. Look, it's turning. Oh. Look how big it is. Oh. Oh my goodness. Oh. oh. <laughs> Dude, he's rising up with your bait. I gotta oh. get him pointed upwards. Eat it. Are you kidding me right now? Oh, he's coming uh -oh. for me. Uh-oh. That's our pike. That's our big pike, <laughs> yeah. <our> pike. <laughs> I think he'll hang around. All right, so I know last year, I gave Tim Hortons a hard time about the roll up the rim, but they've, they've redeemed themselves. They collabed with my favorite Canadian musician, a true icon of Canada, Justin Bieber, and they created something called Tim Biebs. What do you think? I got a 10 pack. We've got, uh, I don't even know. I think this is some sort of cheesecake flavor. We got some sort of chocolate. This is not sponsored by Tim Hortons. I have given Tim Hortons a hard time, but I eat so much Tim Hortons on fishing trips. Pretty good. Yeah, no complaints. 10 out of 10 would recommend. <laughs> not bad. They definitely need to switch their peach juice back though. <laughs> the Tim B's may be good. It does not make up for the peach juice. All right, we're moving. I, I haven't really talked about the rods we're using. I'm using the 38 medium. This is the true grit. Uh, probably like my favorite rattle bait or bigger jigging spoon rod. Hayden? I've got the drench. He's got the drench, which is my favorite just all around rod. It's more of a noodle tip. It's a really good dead stick rod. Works for jigging spoons, works for smaller rattle baits, works for jigs and minnows. Um, thousand size reels. Actually, this one's a 2500, sorry. Thousand size reel, 2500 size reel with five. I think these both have five pound power pro with either a seven or a 12 pound floral leader, but really just cater that to the size of fish you're dealing with. But here, I don't think there's giant walleyes, maybe some decent sized ones, but seven pound is pretty good, uh, depending on Hayden's hook sets. So we're gonna go move around a little bit. It's 10 o'clock. We're only gonna be fishing till probably 1130. They're gonna cook a nice little shore lunch, which you're gonna be a part of. And then we're gonna switch lakes, but that'll be a different video. I think we wanna be a little deeper. I think we're probably in 15 feet, I probably want to be a little, over deep, a little deeper. I think the fish probably slid a little shallower on that point for the sunrise, and now I want to slide deeper. So behind us here is a big, shallow, weedy bay, um, and then this is the main basin behind you there. Hey. So, I'm talking to the camera. Hey. So anyways, we're gonna check the depth here, and then we'll do a little live scope scan, and I want to find some deeper rocks, and like, we we're catching them in 20, I'd like to maybe go 24, 25 right now for midday. All right, we found some deeper rocks. I'm like 25 feet of water. Got a special walleye recipe planned today. Haven't cooked it in a long time. Can't really beat fresh fish out in the lake. So to breath, all those Tim Beebs. Oh, here we go. Oh, yeah, here now we he's go. coming for you. Jameis, Look at again. this. Oh, there's another fish. There's two down there. That's Simu a decent mark. Simulator. And, oh, he's uh, coming for me. Ooh. Whoa, 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 this whoa, might whoa. be the nicest walleye of the day. Oh, it's good. that hook's gonna pop off. <laughs> that hook was so close to going in my hand. <laughs> Look at that. Sweet. That's probably the nicest one yet. There you go. Going back. Cool. Well, moving. Paid off with our nicest walleye of the day. Oh my gosh. That one's nice. Catch that one. Catch that one, Hayden. Less is more. Less is more, Hayden. You sure screwed that one up. Oh. Yep. Nice. Nice. We're on him. <laughs> Jay doesn't trust me taking fish off the hook. I trust you flying. That's about it. Okay. Oh, here we go. Oh, here we boy. go. That's a big fish, I That's think. That's a nice one. I don't know what big, but. 40 incher. Coming up fast. There we go. A, looks like a good mark. Yeah, it's huge. Get get the net, get the gaff, whatever we have accessible. Oh yeah, you were not lying. <laughs> That's but if you hit a ridge or something, line. oh, there's a nice fish. Yeah, the issue. The right. hey, the, hey, 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 hey. The issue look is. That. Look at that. Oh, that's a good one. Yes. Hook set, Hayden. No messing around. Don't screw this up. Nice. That's what we're talking about. Well, wow, that is an angry walleye. So good. That fish was just charged up on the 
live scope machine. All right, going back. It is just about lunchtime. I told Hayden if he flew, I would cook. Yeah, what a day we have. This is this is amazing. I think if it was really cold and you needed a shack and a heater, it'd be a little more difficult to pull this off, but like we strategically picked this because of the, the forecast, so. Oh, look at this, two of them. Oh, there might be three. Oh my goodness. We got a shark tank going on. Oh. That looks like a big fish. That was a nice one. Yeah, that's definitely probably bigger than anything we've had. You can double up, double up. Oh yeah, that's by far the biggest ball yet. Yes! <laughs> Unreal. Unreal. Oh! Oh, whoa, whoa. Yes! <laughs> Baby! That is what I'm talking about. Slapping at the tantrum. All right. That's fun. Oh my goodness. Sweet. Just threw him into my hook. What? <laughs> you just threw him into my hook. Oh. Hooked him on the way down. Oh, look how high this fish is chasing. Eat my tantrum! Oh yeah. It's over. Oh. All right, this is the last one and then we're cooking some lunch. We did say 11 o'clock, it is 10.59. That was how many hours of fishing? Two hours of fishing? Two yep. and a half? Two and a half. Pretty roughly. ridiculous. Oh. All right, let's head back to the plane. All right guys, it's time for the cooking portion of today's video. We've got fresh walleye on the Canadian Shield. All right, got the folding catch and cook knife. That's my plug. We got two beautiful walleyes. Cutting them on the ice isn't ideal, but I didn't really want to bring a cutting board, so. Is that a big mark? Actually? Oh, that is a big fish. Hayden, please make this happen. Is he still there? Yeah. Okay, I need a fish. Oh, wait. Oh, that's not the same one. This is big. This is big? This is a pike. It came in 100 miles an hour. Oh, it's a big walleye. Really? Yeah. Ooh. Oh! <laughs> Dude! You got it out? Yeah. Hold him up for me. Unreal. Dude, we start cooking and the fish are biting. They're all over all right, it down there. Them. Let them go. That's by far the biggest walleye yet. Unreal. Mint! All right, well, I did not do the best job of filleting those. <laughs> I'm gonna be very honest with you guys. We got meat, we're gonna wash these off. So I like for this meal, I like breaking into a little more nugget sizes cause we're gonna toss it afterwards in sauce. So I'm gonna kinda just make a couple chunks, not too many cause it'll make battering a little more difficult. And we're actually just gonna throw the flays right into the bag. And we are gonna do like, these are like boneless wings. I've done it, I've done like a toss in, in Frank's which is a, a very typical thing. I'm not uh, a high end chef like my boy Josh, but uh, I pretty much just douse everything in sauce but we're gonna do some honey garlic. So first, we're gonna drop it in the catch and cook spicy. Mmm. Spicy, so it's a three out of five spicy. I like it, it's, a, it's a, good, a good amount of spice. Canola oil, pan, tongs, a little bit of canola oil. Ooh, we are fogging up. Bam. If you are gonna coat fish in the bag, I'd say either use the whole bag or freeze it or throw it out if, if you think you're not gonna deal with it because yeah, you could have bacteria in there. Otherwise, you, you know, put it out into a plate or something, but. All right, fish is going in. I'd like it a little bit hotter, but no, no, it's all right. That's it. Now we wait. So once we finish deep frying it, we are going to get a little honey and then we're gonna add a little white out garlic seasoning blend. I like using this on potatoes and uh, this is a good opportunity to use it with fish with that honey, the garlic seasoning. It's got a little bit of salt in there too. Mm. This is the shovel I like to use for plating my food from Princess Auto. Do you remember from the other video? I do The remember. shovel fries, the shovel fish. Anyways, I actually bring the shovel anywhere because it's always nice if you need to dig yourself out or cover around your shack. So I, I will actually link this below because I, I do bring it, bring it along on all my trips. But today we're using it for plating food. Because really I'm not- Fish, 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 fish. You can catch my fish. Oh, that's a big fish. 
Yes! Yes, he's got the pike! It's back! It's back! That that thing's gonna be deep, Jay. <laughs> you gotta you gotta reel this thing up. You want me to reel the other one up? Yeah. Ooh. What is it? Ooh. What is it? Big pike. I'm just gonna slowly guide him back. Maybe I can just give her. Nope. Oh, I oh, thought that was it. Oh. <laughs> I couldn't, I, if it was a 10 inch hole, I would have been able to get in there, but. Jay, 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 Jay. Jay, oh. Jay, get him. Got him. Nice. Oh, that's a fat pike. That lure is gone. Okay, we're gonna keep him in the water. Here. Oh my. Can you see on the GoPro how deep that is? <laughs> I'm not sure if the GoPro is gonna show that. It is just gone. Amazing. That is a fat pike. This is what I think has been plaguing us. Tough lighting here, but unreal. What do you think, 36, 37? Nice Stop fish. There. Yeah, big fish. Nice, buddy. Perfect. Right, yeah. Let's slide him home. <laughs> she gone. Perfect. What a morning. Nice. Hey, hey. Stay out of my kitchen. I'm staying out of your kitchen. Stay out of my kitchen. We are pulling the fish out onto the shovel. Huh. Good. I like it nice and crispy for tossing it. The old that. So there's the fish, which we could eat right now. Now we've got some pure honey. I might have to cut it off and scoop it out. Do you cook, I feel like you cook like this at home too. Just let me, Hayden, go back to fishing. <laughs> Here we go. We got some honey. We've got the honey melted down basically. Then the secret ingredient, the garlic seasoning. Add a, add a liberal amount of that. Mm. Now add fresh walleyes via the shovel. Then you need to do the toss. Nice. Oh! <laughs> there you have honey, garlic, walleyes via flow plane. This is pretty, pretty amazing. Is it hot? That's unbelievable. Is it hot? No. Ha. Huh. <laughs> it's so sweet. This is the peach drink that uh, Payne's been complaining about. I think it's good still. It is more refreshing. I take back some of the anger. It's more refreshing than the old one was. Is there a fish? Are we ending it off with this one? Hang on. Yep, oh, let him have it. You're making him chase too much. I'm not moving. You're working a little too much. Oh, this is tiny, Jay. What? I got him though. You caught him? This has been an unbelievable day in the Canadian Shield. Thanks to Hayden. I'll drop his Instagram below. We'll drop Catch and Cook below as well. Princess Auto. It's been a good day, but it's not over. That's the end of this video though. Thank you guys for watching. Please be safe on the ice. And we're going crappie fishing next. See you guys soon.